Hello, I'm CG Astrophotography from Austria and I would like to show you how I take a picture like this or this. After weeks of cloudy nights, it's finally a clear night. Half an hour drive from my home, I'm able to shoot from a dark sky in the mountains, bottle class 2. I always use a program called Stellarium to plan my astro shots. Tonight, my plan is to shoot a mission nebulae in the Sada region, in the constellation Cygnus the Swan which in June rises northeast when it gets dark. It includes the Butterfly Nebula and the nebulae around the star Sadir. Unfortunately, I can't shoot from my balcony because I can't see Polaris from there, so therefore I can't do an accurate polar alignment. The camera I use for Astro is a modified Canon 6D which is more sensitive to hydrogen alpha compared to a stock DSLR. This camera is a perfect fit for the RedCat 51 telescope which I am using for this target. This will be the RedCat's field of view when pairing it with the Canon 6DA. It's a focal length of 250mm and all the nebulae fit perfectly in the frame. Alright, here I was at my favorite astrophotography location and I had an amazing view of the Milky Way. I took a few pictures while my Red Cat 51 was capturing the Sada region. When I arrived there, the crescent moon was setting behind the hills, revealing more and more of the Milky Way. I set up my equipment next to my car the way I showed you at the beginning of the video. The telescope mount the Skyguider Pro was polar aligned, that means the North Star Polaris was in the crosshairs of the Skyguider Pro, slightly off center as it should be, according to the iOptron Polar Scope app. I balanced my telescope, framed up the object, successfully focused on the star Sada, 
thanks to the pattern of mask I'm using, and I was good to go. The individual subframes were 3 minute exposures at ISO 1600, and wow, the emission nebulae can already be clearly seen in one single image. I took around 30 images and stacked them in Deep Sky Stacker. I got 90 minutes total exposure of the SADA region and I'm happy to show you the final result of my imaging session.